Funky D, welcome back, everybody. Ladies and gentlemen, the news say Nasarawa State Police arrest 400 for violating interstate movements. Before we go into this news, ladies and gentlemen, I say make one of the subscribers. Those of you who never subscribe, and for those who are not subscribe, I say thank you very much for subscribing to Funky D. Funky D. You know, see now only this channel. We're not going to get Ubenga, Ubenga, what they call authentic news. We're not there here, eh? To the bend. Eh? Anything when you hear it from this channel, now confirmed. We're not be channel television. We're not be NTE. When they twist news, we're not they twist anything. As it come, now, so we day here, they give on a raw from Canada. Police in Nasarawa has arrested 400. People for violating ban on interstate movement. When I know say state by state, we don't talk, say nobody go to come and nobody go to go out. So where you day, stay where you day. That is movement, stand still. Anywhere where you day, stay where you day. Lockdown, quarantine, everything together. Hmm? So some people now that they tell us now say AK don't bab 400 people in Nasarawa State when we see maybe they won't sneak into another city. Now and then. Capture them. Now the thing when the news they tell us. Police Commissioner Bola Lunch announced the arrest at a briefing after an expanded state council meeting at the government house Lafia on Tuesday. According to him, the police have arrested over 400 persons and will arrest more, especially with the banning of interstate movement by the federal government. We want to appeal to the people of the state to be mindful of the way they are, they are flouting the regulation. We will arrest anybody flouting the regulation. All entry and exit point to the state will be heavily manned and uh, all violators of the restriction of movement will be arrested. Mr. Launch said. So now that one but the thing when the man from the Nasarawa State, the policeman, what they call Mr. Launch. Now they talk now, see man. Anybody, anybody when violate the going out and coming in or the lockdown in that state will be held accountable. See they don't already arrest four hundred people for the matter and they will continue to the arrest people. And the man they send strong one, see man. Stay where you are. Hmm? Don't come in and don't go out from the city. And so the matter be you. And so it be everywhere. Everywhere in Nigeria. And so the law come be now. But we don't hear see a number of state governments led by Obi and no. Say the man don't already hmm, lift the ban. So everybody now they walk up and down in Onecha. A number of states. Hmm? And so the matter be. The news they tell us is Sydney say they don't already approve that loan. What I don't tell them before that 850 billion when 850 billion when President Muhammadu Buhari don't request from the Senate. The Senate has approved President Muhammadu Buhari's request for 850 billion loan from the capital market to finance project in the 2020 budget. Now only all this approval of big big money. Now only that one that they see this uh, senators. Because they won't cut their shares. Now when they won't approve, when they don't approve the thing, now you see, see something will just enter their pocket. I say now only the thing when they say be do now to come approve be big money. If they won't go borrow from China, they know they waste time to approve. If they won't go borrow from anywhere from World Bank, they know they waste time to approve. Now only the thing whether they do. Now it be the long whether they that they make for you. Hmm? Only thing they know they use EEA to hear money. Tell me any other thing now when senators, all the senators now when they claim say they don't elect them since 100 years inside Senate, waiting then they that they do. Now only to approve money. That's all. That's all. Everything when the executive they do, everything when Jubri they do, everything when Buari they do, everything when Mamanda Ora they do, they know they talk about them. The impunity in the country, they know they talk about them. The corruption matter, they know they talk about them. The issue of Hesman and Boko Haram, they never fit make any law when stand by. Now only to approve money in order to waste time. 
two seconds, they don't sign everything. Already, la one don't tell on a say they sign anything when point press one 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 do body. Hmm? They do. Uh -huh. You no go waste time sign them. That's so the man tell on the People Democratic Party PDP has criticized President Muhammadu Buhari over his third coronavirus uh, address on Monday, noting that he offered no solution to protect Nigerians from the pandemic. Now, so they say they might not offer any solution how to protect Nigeria on this deadly disease. And they don't know what an income talk about. Nobody, even some people, they talk, see, they need someone to come interpret. Nigerian, so they need someone to come interpret to them what hmm? Buhari talk about. They're not they hear the Buhari. Nobody hear the Buhari. CNET received President Buhari's request to confirm ROMA. FCC nominees. Big asteroids passing by on Earth tomorrow mocks with face mask. Asteroid, according to them, they say it will pass by tomorrow, everybody. Just in, Senators gives Buhari's nod to obtain 850 billion loan. Can you imagine? They say they give President Buhari, Buhari nod. Hotel in Lagos, Abuja declined to be used as coronavirus quarantine center. I they talk, we say some, some hotels, they're not grew. Even now, we hear say some doctors, when then they can, all of them don't run, leave patients. All of them don't take off. They say, no, look, you know, I don't tell them this thing, see, when this thing set, you know, go see any doctors again. No? Because nobody, they ready to use in life, carry another person, uh, uh, Wahala. Nobody in that country. All the whole doctor, now till next month, you hear, see, Nigeria not get any doctor again. They not get any doctor again. When we help them follow up this issue because government don't fail from A to Z. They know they pay them well. Then they give them nothing to close their mouth. Even that face mask, nothing. So tell me who won't come use his bare face to face somebody when carry COVID-19. So all the whole doctors then go take off from now to next month. You will hear see doctors not in that country again. They in Nigeria not get any single doctor again when go. You know, follow them, do this uh, thing, what did they do? We don't tell on all this on our wuru, on our be APC. Now on our head, on our head, now I will take a rap. Hmm? Doctors, when they for can on our, with the year now, say all of them don't, they don't scamper, they don't take off, they don't want to do nothing because they know they paid them to start with. Don't see something now. The uh, on a um, uh, foreign uh, minister Onyema. Now they talk now. See, hotel in Abuja, Lagos declined to be used as coronavirus quarantine centers. Ministers now they talk. Minister Onyema, Mr. Jeffrey Onyema, the Minister of uh, Foreign Affairs, on Tuesday said most hotel in Abuja and Lagos had refused to be used as quarantine center for Nigeria returnees abroad. <laughs> there is no Nigeria returnees. We don't know if go carry these people come. I don't tell them, I say, if we go carry people from China, make on go carry them come from China, then get how, then get where they come from, then get their houses everywhere. Most of them are rich people. Then get mansions in Nigeria. Even the ones that when they not get, then get mama, then get papa, then get places, then get city, then get villages where they come from. If you won't help these people, our people, our brothers and sisters, when they China, they suffer. Onyema, you don't need to go beg hotel people for quarantine center. You don't need it. Nigeria don't need them. This is another way when they take the dodge. Say, Una no won't help Nigerian people. So make you concentrate, say, Una no they go help them. After all, Una don't talk different kind of things. Leave these people, if you want to bring them from China, or anybody when you see they come from abroad, bring them come. 
then get their family houses, then get where they come from, like I said before. Stop this your hide and seek game when they play, APC people. If you want, go bring them. Go bring them, then go, go quarantine themselves in their houses or in their homes or in their cities, then get everywhere where they come from. You don't need hotel for people, for the returnees. You don't need any hotel when you want to put them in Abuja or in Lagos. Then get where they come from. Like I said, majority of them have their own personal house. When they land, then go go where they come from, go quarantine. So why are you trying to twist things? Because you don't want to go carry, then come back. Because you don't talk, see if they won't come back. See, then go pay their money. Now again, you don't come change, see, then no go pay their money. Now again, you don't come judge and put for hotel. Leave hotel alone. Carry them, come back, then get where they come from. We continue. Onyama also said the affected hotel had rather preferred to be empty than accommodating suspected coronavirus patients. <laughs> These people, they are this minister eh, and the Buhari, they are a problem to that country. The minister disclosed this at the presidential tax force on COVID-19 daily press briefing in Abuja. He explained that the challenge was that the ministry had to look for quarantine center approved by medical expert adding, adding however that most hotel in Abuja and Lagos that were approach we are not willing to be used onyama however stated that the ministry had been able to identify some hotel in lagos and abuja which according to him the governor of lagos state played a significant role to secure some hotel in lagos so before the government of nigeria go say they won't do something they don't kill our people they don't kill all of them when they for china so, on uh, know the game when on uh, they play. If you want to go bring your people, go bring your people, leave hotels. I say before, on uh, go do what uh, they do finish now. Uh, they don't kill our people in China. Then I wonder who on uh, our go, go bring come again from China if they don't kill them. So, it is important if you uh, want to bring them, make uh, just go bring them right now and stop playing games. With people's life. Because the APC government, they like to play games with people's life. They like to, they, they, they love to see you dying, APC and PD people, than to help you out. They know our people are suffering in China, but they will come out and begin to make some kind of uh, laws and, uh, you know, all these stupid things that they are doing. Just exactly the same way they are doing. You know yes if you want help people help people if you don't want help go sit down on yama and fg nobody they beg on us they make on our come the time when they beg on her the time when they beg on her eh? it don't pass so nobody they beg on her again so ladies and gentlemen i see those are brothers when they China, when I go be very, very careful because now, now they China, they when I know how Chinese people, when I know how them, how them be, the way whether they operate before when I go there. So, I don't tell when I see President Trump say he go send ventilators to Nigerian government. This one, uh, the same Nigerian government, when um, Femi Adeshina don't go, go on, don't use the mouth talk any as see Americans say they not be world police. But since when they slam them, since when they blacklist them, we not see Femi Adeshina come out again. After I don't talk, see the American president, they not be world police. A lot of things there, if we continue, we're not going to live here today. Another President Buhari friend, don't die again. 
another president Buhari's friend don't die again, according to waiting the news they tell us. Then they call the man uh, Shehu of Bama. They say nine die from undisclosed sickness. Make we just read a little bit, make we take conclude this uh, segment. Buhari mom's kakiare, Shehu of Bama dies from undisclosed ailment. Buhari. Alahaji Ibrahim Kiari Ibam Uma El Kanami, the Shehu of Bama of Bonu State, is dead. The State Commissioner of Information Alahaji Babakura Abba Jato made the disclosure on Monday in Medugri. Abba Jato said that the first class traditional ruler passed away at the University of Medugri Tech Teaching Hospital, UMTH, of yet to be disclosed, he meant. We are expecting a more detailed statement from Bama's Emirate, Abajato said. So, they come down here, they come see President Muhammad Buhari have expressed sadness over the passing of the Emir of Bama, describing him as a humble and on assuming traditional ruler the demise of Kiare El Kanami is not only a loss to Bonu state but the country at large President Buhari said in condolence statement in Abuja on Monday it is said they it is said a loss to the whole country at large who know uh, Shehu of Bama which country is this man talking about Later, we go learn about the countries when Buhari they talk about all their jubilee they call every day, all the shadow government that they call every day because everything what they do with Nigerian people must come. One love, everybody. I say, make on the subscribe and make on a mission. Sure see, on not forget to press that person so that anytime when Funky D, Funky D, one upload, no first get my videos. One love from Canada.